a tricky touchdown on Alligator Alley, a small plane forced to turn the highway into a runway. Well, something went wrong with the plane while it was in the air. Incredibly, nobody was hurt here. Local 10 News reporter Roy Ramos standing by live in West Broward County with our top story tonight. Roy. Andrew Antonella, throughout the night we have seen a consistent flow of traffic here on the lanes of I-75. Fortunately, that was not the case when two pilots started having engine trouble and they were forced to make an emergency landing. Drivers passing this single engine Cessna, but this strip of asphalt isn't a runway. This is I-75. Broward Sheriff Fire Rescue responded to the interstate near mile marker 30 just after 5 in the evening Saturday when they said the plane was forced to land on the highway because of a mechanical issue. They immediately came off to the side of the road to set up a cone and so traffic kept flowing through the side. Eddie Louie with Wayman Aviation Academy told me two people were aboard the plane, an instructor with close to 1,500 hours of flight time and a trainee. The student is getting towards the end of his training as well, so we really had the best situation with very experienced pilots. Louie said the two were flying across the state from Punta Gorda back to the flight school in Opalaca when they started to experience roughness in the engine, similar to turbulence you'd feel in a commercial flight. While investigators still don't officially know what caused the mechanical issue, Louie believes the engine wasn't getting the necessary fuel. At this time of year, with the weather and the moisture in the air, uh, we see often what's called carburetor icing. It restricts fuel flow. Fortunately, before the sun set, they were able to see the open lanes of traffic and make a safe landing with no damage caused to the plane either. As the wings of the aircraft were taken off and the plane was towed away, it's the decision these pilots made, Louis believes, may have saved their lives. That's exactly what flight training is all about, is for the tough situations like this. And when I spoke to that instructor, he told me if you happen to find yourself on the lanes of traffic, you look up and you see an aircraft, treat it as if you would an ambulance and slowly move out of the way. As for this emergency landing, the NTSB is now investigating. Here in West Broward, Roy Ramos, Local 10 News.